Two sets of 10 Talgo trains have been acquired by the Lagos State Government for the Red Line Rail Project. This is in fulfillment of Governor Babajide Samuolu's administration to make transportation easier, faster and affordable. Governor Samuolu completed the acquisition deal of the trains at the Milwaukee facilities of Spanish train manufacturer Talgo Incorporated in the United States on Tuesday. Our State House correspondent, Love Ikuku Oyedoku, reports. The acting Milwaukee mayor, Kavila Johnson, receives Governor Samuolu and his team to the city. The governor and his delegation inspect the interior design of the newly acquired Talgo trains with a speed limit of 330 km per hour. The intracity metropolitan trains are a boost for the Red Line project to kick off. A train is not something you just, just you know, go on the shelf and pick up. Right? And so we were very, we were pretty challenged knowing where we can get you know, brand new trains like this. And so we're very, very lucky that our partnership and our conversations with some of our partners here started with, uh, with Talgo about a month, a month and a half ago. And because of Christmas and New Year, we couldn't, you know, close it up. But I'm so, so excited that um, within the, you know, the first month of the year, we've been able to take a trip, a very deserving one for that matter. And we've seen a beautiful white and red tree. You know, coincidentally, the rail line is called a red line. It's called a red line. And so you can see They've given us the color as well. So we're just going to brand in and put up our, our seal there. Chief Executive Officer and President Talgo USA, Antonio Perez, warns against not putting the trains to use. He shows gratitude for the purchase. With a capacity of 500,000 passengers daily, the red line will have 11 stations and when completed, will be the first operational metro systems in West Africa. From Lagos, Love Ikuku Uyidoku. Reporting for Plus TV, Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.